get yeah. it. Yeah, and speaking of walking, mm -hmm. you, you like to go for walks on your lunch break. Yeah. Today might be the only day you'll, you'll be able to get out there and it's dry. I think tomorrow, because the rain is coming in later tomorrow, right? Yeah. So but today is, yeah, it's like the only... It's the pick day of the week. Oh, my, oh man, we're already going to have the pick day of the week on a Monday? Already on a Monday. Oh, my goodness. Is that a good thing for the pick day of the week to be on a Monday? Or I mean, it helps it, Monday, it but... It can go both ways here. You know, you it don't have much Monday. to look forward to. That's the problem. <laughs> but you have something to look forward to. Yeah, today. yeah, I'll, I'll make sure to get my walk in. Yeah, That's definitely sure. get those steps in today. Overall, will be fairly dry, seeing overcast skies no matter where you are. But today, I'm going to go with overall a green paw kind of day for today because we're seeing overcast skies. We're seeing those temperatures go from the 50s this morning back to the upper 60s near 70 by this afternoon. So Loa, love that name first off. Go ahead and get outside for today. I'm talking as if I'm actually talking to you right now. Loa, all the dogs out there, go ahead and get outside for today. All the dog owners, trust me, I'm right there with you. You want to take your pups out for a super long walk because by the end of the week and the weekend, we're all going to be going crazy just being cooped up inside all day. But the nice thing is we'll get breaks from the rain at times. A few light showers possible in our southern counties, not lasting long. Just a little bit of rain for this afternoon and this evening. Mostly clear skies overnight into tomorrow morning. Now, like Amanda said, most of tomorrow looks to be fine. We're heading out the door tomorrow. That mixture of sunshine and clouds. Here's lunchtime, seeing lots of sunshine. But the more sunshine we see, the higher the instability in the atmosphere to really fire up those storms later on in the day. So we want to see more clouds rather than sunshine, but looks like it's going to be 50 50. Here's 5 p.m. Those showers start to move into our western counties, but look how quick this moves out of here. Here's 5 o'clock. Fast forward. Here's 9 p.m. It shifts off to our eastern counties and our biggest threat with these storms, heavy rain, strong winds, lightning, thunder. That chance for a tornado is very low, but I just want to mention there is that potential for strong storms in the central plains for today. We're not seeing anything that intense, but if you have loved ones in Oklahoma, in Kansas and Texas, make sure that they are weather aware, but it's going to definitely be a soggy few days ahead. We're seeing those storms set tomorrow, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Tuesday. Back to you guys. Man. I know. Sorry. I know. Womp. Hey, My backyard is swamped. You know, too. you know what? It's dry today. It is. So we'll take that. Yes. We'll take and it the was good. dry most of the day yesterday. Yeah, it was.